you know, a uh, couple of shots tonight. You, you feel like you're back off the schneid or the slump is over? Yeah, no. I mean, I don't think I was in a slump. I think I missed a few shots. I think, you know, I was able to make a few at the end. Um, but, yeah, I, I just don't I don't ever uh, try to over-evaluate my shooting or consider a few misses a slump or anything like that because uh, at the end of the day, I know that um, if I just stay consistent, uh, the shots will drop for me. Were you feeling a little bit of pressure, though, in the last you know few days, weeks, games? No, uh, not from, really. From the no. team or the coach? You know, when I was, um, you know, earlier in the in my years in the NBA, I think you know I would have overthought that a little bit, but I understand that that's just that can get to you, and, and there's going to be you know a couple games that maybe get patched together that you don't get a lot of looks, uh, and that can be confused as you're not making shots. Um, and to be honest, I feel like that was kind of what this was. I wasn't, you know, shooting 0 for 10. It was that I was maybe shooting two shots. Not getting shots. Um, and so, you know, I don't want to over-evaluate that because when I'm shooting all by myself in the gym, sometimes I'll miss, miss two, three, four in a row. And, you know, in a in span of games that, you know, could be two, three games. So I just try not to over-evaluate it. What impact does Raymond have on your game specifically? Yeah, I mean, he just he draws the defenses. He puts pressure on those guys. I mean, tonight you saw again he had nine assists. Um, when he's passing the ball like that, you know, guys like me, guys, I mean, just anybody who's on the perimeter for us, Carvello, even, you know, you know, I mean, just the guys that are shooting from the outside benefit from it, and um, he does such a good job of finding guys. See, what was the conversation in the locker room after the, the first quarter, and especially the second, of the first half when you guys allowed 51? Yeah, I mean, it's just, you know, it's not what, it's not our identity. We need to be able to stop guys when they get hot like that. And, uh, you know, it's happened a few times, but you know, we'll continue to make adjustments. And I think, um, you know, we have gotten better and better at, at recognizing them. And, some, and sometimes we uh, have a little confusion, but I feel like, you know, whenever something like that happens, it helps us improve. Do you see Tyson make the adjustment in terms of the pick and roll where he's getting it where he wants it above the rim? Yeah, you know, when he's able to get those lobs like that at the rim, he plays great. I think he had 21 points tonight, and obviously, I mean, that's that's great for us because we're scoring inside. You know, defenses are going to have to pay attention to that, and um, that opens Melo up and takes a lot of pressure off him too. Obviously, tonight Melo didn't have to, you know, go crazy, but he still shot the ball well, and Tyson was able to go to work. Amari's had a pretty strong stretch here. What kind of an impact does that have on you guys? What yeah. he's doing, what he can do out there? Yeah, it's huge. It's huge having a guy who we can throw it into like that, and he can just. You know, attack the basket. Um, you know, obviously Melo can do it, but to have a second guy that you can throw it to and, and do that, and obviously Tyson scores down low, but it's on so much energy and rebounding, that kind of thing. And, you know, with stat, you know, the way he just is able to attack the rim, it's, I mean, it's so valuable. Fourth quarter, seven three point field goals for the team. What opened up there for you? Yeah, you know, I think they were trying some different defensive schemes. They were kind of scrambling around trying to make something happen, and we just uh, spread the floor, and uh, the guys just, you know, broke the press and got the ball up and moved it around. So, we got some good looks at it. I mean, I think we got three decent looks, you know, to be honest, the whole night. I think, you know, for me, my, my shot was I had great looks. Some of them just went in, some of them didn't.